Hey, this is James Glass, and I wanted to talk about the correct installation of shower drain assemblies into precast acrylic or fiberglass showers. This also works for tubs. This happens to be a shower. So you can buy this shower drain kit. It comes with the pieces that you see here. And um, the, the kit consists of a basket, which... Um, is solvent welded, glued basically into the PVC that goes to the P-trap. That has the female threads in it. The top portion has the male threads. You tighten the two together to squish into the tub, and that's that holds it in place. And it comes with a paper gasket, a rubber gasket, and then that's just the strainer that pops on top. The gaskets go on the bottom. The gaskets never go on top. The gaskets go on the bottom. That gasket is designed to seal to the bottom of the tub, the rubber one. The paper gasket is designed to go next to the, to, the, to the PVC so that when you tighten it, it doesn't bite in and bunch up the rubber gasket. The paper gasket is basically a material that significantly reduces friction so that you can turn that and get a good seal. And they don't have to be tight, super crazy, insane, you know, big breaker bar tight. We're talking about about a turn past hand tight. So underneath the tub, this goes, this is, this goes into the pipe. Paper gasket goes on, rubber gasket goes on. Up top, the sealant that's used is either 100% silicone, doesn't matter if it's one or two. One takes a little bit longer to dry and smells more, but either one is fine, 100% silicone. Put a liberal bead all the way around, drop that into your tub, Come in from underneath and screw this assembly up and come back and clean up the silicone. You can use plumber's putty, um, but for this, these applications and uh, some stone, some granite, silicone is recommended. Plumber's putty is great because it's not an adhesive. Silicone, once it sets up, it's, it, it's an adhesive. It glues everything together. But I, um, uh, I don't want to deal with growing under the crawl space 20 years from now when my plumber, plumber's putty dries up. So I'm just putting the silicone here because it'll last my lifetime. So that's it. Gaskets on the bottom. Paper gasket goes next to the PVC, then rubber. Silicone or plumber's putty, your choice. I use silicone up on top. And then when you're all done, pop the strainer in. There you go.